Welcome to Now Global, where we delve into the rights of women and girls in North Korea. Despite official claims of gender equality, the lived experiences of many women in North Korea reveal a starkly different reality, characterized by discrimination, violence, and limited opportunities. Discrimination and gender-based violence Traditional Confucian patriarchal values are deeply embedded in North Korean society, shaping the lives of women from childhood. Girls are raised to believe they are inferior to boys, leading to a normalization of gender discrimination. This discrimination extends into adulthood, impacting women's access to education, employment, and healthcare. Women who challenge these norms often face social stigma and ostracization. In North Korea, Gender discrimination is not just a social norm, but is also enshrined in the legal system. Women are often excluded from decision-making processes and leadership roles, both in the political sphere and within their own families. This lack of representation perpetuates gender stereotypes and limits women's ability to advocate for their rights. Political representation and leadership. Despite some progress in recent years, Women remain significantly underrepresented in positions of power within the North Korean government and ruling party. While the number of women in leadership roles has increased, this has not translated into substantive policy changes benefiting women and girls. Political representation is crucial for ensuring that women's voices are heard in decision-making processes. However, in North Korea, women are often sidelined in favor of men who are seen as more capable and authoritative. This lack of representation only hinders women's advancement, but also perpetuates the patriarchal norms that govern North Korean society, violence and domestic abuse. Domestic violence is a pervasive issue in North Korea, often considered a private matter. Women who experience domestic abuse face significant barriers in seeking help, including a lack of support services and social stigma. Cases of sexual harassment and violence, even in public spaces, often go unreported and unpunished. The normalization of domestic violence in North Korea is deeply concerning. Women are often taught to prioritize the family's reputation over their own safety, leading to underreporting of abuse. Additionally, the lack of legal protections for survivors of domestic violence further perpetuates this cycle of abuse. Economic Empowerment Prior to the COVID-19 pandemic, women played a vital role in the North Korean economy, particularly in informal markets where they served as primary breadwinners for their families. However, women working in these markets faced increased discrimination and harassment from authorities. The role of women in the North Korean economy is often underestimated. Women are not only responsible for providing for their families, but also for managing household finances and ensuring the well-being of their children. Despite these contributions, women are often overlooked in economic policy decisions and lack access to resources that could empower them economically. Impact of COVID-19 The COVID-19 pandemic has had a disproportionate impact on women in North Korea. Measures to control the spread of the virus, such as border closures and restrictions on movement, have further marginalized women, leading to increased economic hardship and the reversal of some of the gains made in recent years. The pandemic has highlighted the vulnerabilities faced by women in North Korea, particularly those in marginalized communities. Women who were already struggling to make ends meet have been pushed further into poverty, exacerbating existing inequalities. Additionally, the closure of schools and childcare facilities has placed an additional burden on women, who are often responsible for caregiving duties. International response and humanitarian efforts. The international community has a role to play in addressing the rights of women and girls in North Korea. Humanitarian organizations and governments can support local initiatives that promote gender equality and provide assistance to women and girls in need. International pressure and advocacy have the potential to bring about meaningful change in North Korea. By supporting grassroots movements and providing resources to organizations working on the ground, 
the international community can help empower women and girls and advance gender equality in North Korea. Education and Health Access to education and healthcare is limited for many women and girls in North Korea. Gender stereotypes and traditional roles often restrict women's access to educational opportunities, leading to lower literacy rates and limited awareness of their rights. Education is key to empowering women and girls in North Korea by providing access to quality education, particularly in rural areas. Women can gain the knowledge and skills needed to advocate for their rights and pursue opportunities for personal and professional development. Additionally, access to healthcare services is crucial for ensuring the well-being of women and girls in North Korea, particularly in light of the challenges posed by the COVID-19 pandemic. Cultural and social factors Cultural and social factors also contribute to the challenges faced by women in North Korea. The pressure to conform to traditional gender roles and societal expectations can limit women's freedom and opportunities for advancement. In North Korean society, women are often expected to prioritize the needs of their families over their own ambitions. This cultural expectation can lead to women being overlooked for opportunities for education and employment. Additionally, the emphasis on maintaining social harmony can discourage women from speaking out against injustices and seeking help when they are in need. Family and marriage. Family and marriage play a significant role in the lives of women in North Korea. Women are often expected to prioritize their roles as wives and mothers over their own personal ambitions, leading to limited opportunities for education and employment. The institution of marriage in North Korea is governed by strict gender roles with women expected to be submissive to their husbands. This can lead to women being trapped in abusive relationships with few options for escape. Additionally, the lack of legal protections for women in marriage further exacerbates this vulnerability. Future prospects and recommendations. Despite the challenges, there is hope for improvement in the rights and status of women in North Korea. Increased awareness, advocacy, and support from the international community can help empower women and girls in North Korea and promote gender equality. Moving forward, it is essential to prioritize the rights and well-being of women and girls in North Korea. This includes implementing policies that promote gender equality, providing access to education and healthcare, and supporting initiatives that empower women economically and socially. By working together, we can create a more equitable, and just society for all individuals, regardless of gender. The situation facing women and girls in North Korea is complex and multifaceted. By raising awareness of these issues and supporting efforts to promote gender equality, we can work towards a future where all individuals, regardless of gender, have equal rights and opportunities. Thank you for joining us on this journey to understand the hidden reality of North Korean women's rights. Share your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe and share. See you next time.